Hi everyone, so I am back to do another review. I felt like doing some reviews today, so I am going to film a couple of videos at the same time. So if you wonder why I look the same, that is why. So this time I am going to review the MUA uh, Undress Me 2 palette. And this is supposed to be a dupe for the Naked 2 palette. And I only own the Naked 3 palette, so I couldn't tell you if it's a dupe or not. But it looks like that inside it comes with this applicator that I never use. And it has 12 shades and they are both matte and shimmery colors. And these ones actually have names on the back of them. So it looks like that on the back. So here you can see the names of the colors. So I really love this palette. I think MUA colors, eyeshadow colors are really good. I have... I only have one palette I think from MUA before and that is the Undressed palette, the dupe for the Naked One palette. So I got this one and I'm really, really happy about it that I got it. I've been eyeing it for a long time and it's always sold out. So these are I think £4 or £4.50 on MUA's website. I think they are also sold at like Superdrug or something in the UK. But they are really buttery, nice blend color. I highly recommend them and I will swatch them for you. So let's start with this one that's naked and that is a matte shade. And that is that right there. The second shade is, is it? Devotion right here and next to naked right there is more of a goldy golden shade goldy bronze shade but more gold than the bronze and that is the shimmery one and I should say that naked is like a matte cream shade next to devotion is shy and this is a shimmer shimmery champagne color and that is that right there and next to it is Fiery, have to read what it says. Fiery, and that is more of a coppery color, also shimmer. So that is right there, that's coppery. No, that's fiery, but the coppery color. And next to that is lavish, and that is a matte color. And I will place that. Maybe that won't show up that well, but there is, was it lavish? Yeah, lavish. It's right there. Doesn't show up really well, but it's perfect for like a crease color or a transition color. Lastly, on this side is, on the, on the top right there, is, I have to see what it says. It says dreamy. And this is a darker shimmery color that looks like... That. You can see it right there. That is dreamy. So it's like a dark brown with maybe some bronze to it. And moving on to the second row right here, we have Tranquil. And this is kind of like a brownie taupe. You have some taupes in this. And I will place that right there. So there is Tranquil right there. And next to that is Exposed, and that is more of a grey color, it's right there. And there is like a, I don't know, a steel grey or a gunmetal color, so there. Also shimmer as you can see. Next to that is Reveal, and that's a, a lighter kind of grey. Almost a little like, I don't know, Max Patina, maybe right there. Also shimmer as you can see, it doesn't say, but it is kind of grey. And with a little hint of like a light brown in it. Next to reveal is Wink, right there, it's kind of a dark, darker taupe color. And we will, yeah, that is definitely like a lilac-y brownie grey taupe color 
and that is there. Very, very pretty color. And two colors left, and we have Obsession, this dark one right here. And this is like a dark, I don't know, what, how should I call this? A dark brown, some more matte than shimmery, but I think it's supposed to be shimmer color. But it doesn't look that shimmery. And a dark brown with like purple undertone in it right there. And the last color is corrupt and that is a black. And the black is matte. And that black is black. So let's put it there. That is a black. That is a real black color. A little powdery, the black one. But other than that, it is black. See, it stained my finger. I can't get the color off. That is very, very black. So these are the colors of the Undress Me 2 palette. I really like it and for the price, you can't beat it. I mean, the MUA palettes are really good and yeah, I can highly recommend this and if you can get a hold of it. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want me to do a look with this palette, then let me know and I will try to do that for you. I have actually had one in my mind that I might do. So if that is something that you would like to see, then comment down below and tell me. And I will certainly do that. So if you will have anything else that you want me to review or something kind of video that you want me to, to film, please comment down below and tell me because I always, always need help with video ideas. I have crazy bad <laughs> imagination sometimes. So I always happily can take the recommendations or video requests from you guys. And yeah, as always, please comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in another video. Bye, guys!